Hello. Hey, um, is anyone home? Oh, there you are. Um, how are you? Yeah, I know we haven't talked much since you moved here. I really should have gotten to know my cute neighbor better. It's times like these, though, when you really need to know people. Oh, what's going on? Well, I stopped by because um, I heard you used to be a plumber before you moved out here. Is that true? Oh, just my luck. I hate to ask you for this, but could you help me with my sink? Pretty please? Yeah, I would so appreciate it. My kitchen is flooded. Yeah, completely. I think a pipe busted everywhere under my sink. There's about a half an inch of water pooled across my whole kitchen. I know, it's crazy. Well, what happened? I woke up this morning and I went to wash my dishes from breakfast like normal, right? So, I turn on my sink and immediately water is dripping from underneath, like out the cabinet. Yeah, I turned off the faucet immediately. Then I open the cabinet and there's water everywhere. I mean, all of my stuff underneath got ruined. Ugh, yeah, it's awful. Is there any chance I could borrow you for an hour to help me out? You could really make my day so much better. But it kind of has to be right now. Or I'm worried that it'll get so much worse. Really? You're free right now? Oh, really? Are you sure? You would really be making my day so much better. Ugh, oh my gosh. You're make saving my life right now. I'm so sorry. I just asked all this of you and I didn't even introduce myself at all. My name's Luna. I'm your neighbor on the top floor. What's your name? Ugh. Gosh, I will literally name my first child after you. Seriously, this is saving me such a headache. You really could come up and check right now? Ugh, you're such a lifesaver. Let's go. Ah, of course. Let me give you a second to grab your tools. My bad. All set? Okay, great. So, my apartment is just up this way. Uh, 
Ugh, for real, you are saving me big time. Yeah, seriously, this has been such terrible timing. Nothing is going right this morning. Yeah, I accidentally woke up and had the worst migraine. And then I dropped a plate while I was making breakfast, and now this. I was about to head to a doctor's appointment, but I had to cancel it. Seriously, just see how much water there is. You'll understand. Ugh, and I didn't want to have to call someone and shell out more money, even though I just had repairs done. You are seriously the best. Yeah, do you see this huge mess? I can't even really get it up yet. More water just keeps coming. It's starting to seep into the carpet and everything. Um, did I turn off the water? On the sink? Um, I mean, it's not on right now. You mean, turn off the water supply? I had no idea you could do that. Gosh, I feel so clueless. I just don't know anything about this stuff, and I live alone here. Thank God you know what's going on. Can you teach me how to do that sometime? How to turn off the water? Oh yeah, we'll wait to test out where the leak is coming from. So, okay, I guess let's open this cabinet. Sorry, I have to get everything out from under here. One sec. Yeah, I removed like anything I was storing under there that wasn't in a plastic bottle. Just have to get all these cleaning supplies out. Okay, um, it should be all set for you. Are you sure I should turn the faucet on? Like, will it make a bigger mess? I just don't want to turn it on and everything gets wetter. Well, okay, I guess here I go. See, it's like coming out at this part here. Yeah, do you um, think this is fixable? Should I shut off the water again right now? Okay. You look like you were getting totally sprayed down. You're soaking wet right now. So, what's going on with it? For real? Just needed a bolt tightened? Wait, you already fixed it? Seriously? You were able to just tighten it with your hands? Oh, wow. You must have been really strong to do that. So, can you teach me about turning the water off now? Crap. I need a wrench? Um, I think I have a toolkit somewhere. I'll have to find it. Oh, you brought one in your kit, duh. Geez, saving the day again. You have really, really been so helpful. I could really learn 
a lot from you. Okay, so let me get down here. So I need to hook the wrench onto this thing right here. Oh, it's a bracket. I don't even know what these are called. Okay, so these two are the supply lines. Okay, let me try it. Mm. Dude, I cannot get this thing to budge. No, seriously, I don't think I have the upper arm strength for this. There's like so much water coming out right now. Uh, God, can you get in here and rescue me? I thought I would be able to do this on my own, but I can't. Me here trying to be independent and messing it all up. <laughs> I feel like an idiot. This is why I need someone like you in my life. And sheesh. Oh, my t-shirt is totally wet now. Um, has it turned see-through? Gosh, sorry. Embarrassing. I look like a total mess today. God, thanks so much for your help. You know... I can see what everyone else is talking about. Oh, um, just I've heard that you are super helpful and hands-on. I mean, look at your hands. They're just so veiny and thick and... I am saying honestly too much right now. I just, I actually used to be a nurse. I haven't seen a lot of arms as vascular as yours. No, I do not flirt with my patients. I can't believe you'd think I'd do such a thing. I might look, but I don't touch. Some of my patients are hot, but my plumbers are hot too. Could I ask you for another favor? I actually have this other leaky pipe. It's in my bedroom. Since you fixed this one so easily, do you think you could fix the other one too? Ugh, gosh, you really are the best. I wish I had someone as strong as you around. No, don't worry. You're not gonna have to rip out the ceiling or something, I promise this will be quick. Let me just show you what I mean. Come, come on, hold my hand. I'll drag you there if I have to. Mm, yeah, so this is my bedroom. Um, if you want to sit right there for a second. Yeah, 
No worries, of course you can sit on my bed. Sorry. One second. I'm just gonna change my shirt. Would you mind turning around? No, really, no peeking. Ah, okay, there we go. So, I know I said I had a leaky pipe, but I lied. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's just that, you know, I saw you move in and I thought you were really hot. Like I find you so manly and rugged. Yeah, I mean, gosh, this is going to sound so silly, but I didn't actually know if you had any real plumbing experience. I just thought you would maybe, since you seem so handy and I've heard you helped out a couple neighbors. And it would give me an excuse to get you into my apartment. Sorry if I'm totally wasting your time and you have something else to get to. I don't know what exactly came over me this morning. But I just thought, well, with an actual emergency, it was the right time to get to know you. Yeah, it sounds so silly now. It's just been nice to have a crush on the neighbor. Like, imagining if when I leave my curtains open, maybe you catch a glimpse looking up at me. Gosh, <laughs> I'm saying too much. I swear, you've only a little bit been always on my mind. So, one thing is, I'm just not really sure, like, how to repay you for your services. Do you have any ideas? Um, wow. Well, if you take reviews somewhere, I would give five stars. Yeah, this has been the best plumber experience I've ever had. You're so nice and knowledgeable, showing me how to fix things, showing me other things. I think I probably still owe you for this, since I need to ask if you can check my pipes again tomorrow. Yeah, I might have a few of them that need cleaning out. Are you free for that? 
I just, I might have a lot of pipes to check. Um, okay, I'll see you tomorrow and we can get the rest of my bedroom fixed up.